Hello, this is Eric at the Prince George Ford Pre-Owned Super Center, and we're taking a look at the 2022 Ford Bronco Sport in a Badlands trim and powered by a 2-liter EcoBoost engine, providing you with excellent power and fuel efficiency with four-wheel drive capabilities, so you're going to be able to get around pretty well. But let's take a look inside. First, looking into the back, we have a pretty spacious cargo area that can always be expanded by folding down the rear seats, and you have a rugged cargo floor here that... Uh, can be lifted up and out of the way to reveal the full-size spare in the back with some extra room around it. And on either side you have these little tie-down points with lassos on them, 12-volt power outlet, 110-volt power outlet, and on this side you have the button to activate your articulatable uh, cargo lights, which is pretty nice too. And then looking into the back seat, we have comfortable seating for three with a full leather interior, fold-out armrests with two cup holders, as well as having a 110-volt power outlet, USB and USB-C. And the backs of the seats have these zippered pouches, as well as molly rigging, so you can hook equipment onto there. This vehicle does have a remote start, so no need to go outside on those cold mornings to warm up your SUV. And looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as a fully power adjustable driver's seat. Now sitting in the vehicle with it running, you can see it's sitting at 6,296 kilometers. And moving down to the steering wheel, on the right hand side you have your hands-free phone, or sorry, you have your controls for your center info screen where you can cycle through your trip information, tire pressures, now playing, fuel economy, and then you can also go into settings and service info. Um, but then moving on to the left, three of your cruise controls, as well as having your hands-free phone and radio controls along the bottom, and your lane keeping system on the end of your signal stock. But then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is radio series and Bluetooth capable, so you have some options there. Bluetooth phone controls, whatever apps you may have installed, and settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle. Shifting into reverse, you do have a backup camera so you can see where you're going and hopefully avoid hitting anything. Above that, you do have a premium B&O sound system, so your audio is gonna sound pretty decent. But then moving down, you have your media controls, hazards, auto start, stop, shut off, and your camera view for your front facing camera as well. Um, and then moving down, you have a little cubby area here, then your climate controls with dual zone front climate, heated front seats, and a heated steering wheel so you can stay cozy. Down below you have this cubby area with a 12 volt USB and USB-C as well as a wireless charging pad so if your phone's compatible throw it on there to power or charge. Then you have your main shifter here on a dial, very convenient. Parking brake, brake hold, two cup holders, and then you have your 4x4 controls here. So you have four wheel drive lock, locking rear differential, traction control shut off, and trail control, which is sort of like uh, cruise control for lower speeds on rougher terrain. And then you have your goat mode selector. So you have normal, eco, sport, slippery, mud ruts, sand, and rock crawl modes. So you can customize your driving experience quite a bit there. And then you have your center compartment slash armrest, which is pretty spacious inside with a USB and USB-C. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, come visit us at Prince George Ford, pg4.ca, or call 250-563-8111 and have a nice day.